Hey, welcome back, my YouTube friends, to my scrapping pages. And it's where I teach you how to make eight and a half by 11 scrapbook pages. All right. So, welcome, welcome, my friends. All right. I'm using the Vintage Linen Market from Simple Stories. Um, I don't use any templates to um, create these um, layouts, I just create them right along with you. Um, I will be releasing the videos every Friday morning. So, when you get up, you should have um, be right in your YouTube. All right. Let's see. Yeah, better say that one. All right. I have a sheet of the tags. because There's two sheets of um, each one. So, I think I'm going to cut these. like that then I gotta take a half an inch and see which ones do I want to use these two I think all right so a half an inch off each end to get it 11 all right so there's one One. All right. So these are four inches. I was trying to see four and six would be ten, so that would be good. All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut this in half at six. Okay. Oh, cut it down to eleven. Now I'm gonna cut this in half. All right. So to get, let's see, I'm going to put this on my grid. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and a half would be here. I think that'd be perfect. All right. I could actually cut a little bit more off so we could have the strip if we wanted it. Do we want it? Yeah, let's do. Okay, let me just double check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and a half would be here. So I could cut off three quarters of an inch. cut that off both pieces that way we'd have some journaling spots just some little journaling spots mm, I was also thinking about clipping so if we like to use the green just for example that way the green would come through I don't know do I have another piece of I have blue cardstock Let's do it. I know it's going to take time, but I think it'll be well worth it. We could even cut out the little holes if we wanted to. Now, do we want to use the blue? I 
the green is kind of well i don't know the blue is almost well we'll see what let's get these i do have yellow yellow might be nice Um, so I only find my yellow. I uh, know I kind of like the green. Yep, I'm going with the green. Alright, so this piece here is a leftover piece. Um, it is... Oops, geez, oops. Almost two inches. So I'm just going to go under a hair under like seven eighths. Oh, and that wasn't quite crap. I hope that's enough. Yeah, it's enough. Phew. Okay. So now, I'm just going to glue these. And I forgot I need to cut it down to 11 inches. All right. Okay, let's get the other side glued. Now we can glue this. Let's yeah, let's glue a yellow on top. Um, let's see how much room I got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and a half. So about three quarters of an inch. Or half an inch, sorry. Okay, there's that one. So now I'm going to use, let's go ahead and glue this. I'm just going to use this one as a template. Yeah, I moved it. the ways all right if 
There we go. Beautiful as it sits. So now, all right, do I want to use? Six by eight paper pad. I'm going to tap these a little bit so they don't slide. Try and get them in the middle. So now we have that. Um, do I want to use black? Let's uh, take these. Change my mind. I want these right up against the edge. There, like that. So now, so five and a half, do I want to use, yeah, let's do it. So five and a half. Five and a half, and we're gonna go by five. Okay, by five. Okay, cut five and a half again. You're going to need four of these. So like that. Or should we go by five? Yeah, let's let's go by five. Sorry about that. Or I'm sorry. Let's go by four and three quarters. 
so we have just a little bit more room in between the two okay so it's four and three quarters this way okay So something like that. Now for the strip in the middle. What do I want to use? I did cut. That's kind of neat. So let's cut this in half. So we got 11 inches, so five and a half. That's going to be the same as those. those I think I'm gonna um, angle it this way kind of like a banner I don't know what you call it banner style Oh, I like it. I like it. Now I'm just kind of looking at my flowers just to see. Oh, that hides the banner thing. Yeah. Or we could just put them in the middle. That's kind of pretty. Or we can put sunny days in one. Maybe like that. Yeah, I think I like it. Yeah, I like it. All right. I'm 
moving on. All right. So now what are we going to do? Let's do... We're getting quite a bit of scraps over here. I hate to leave those all towards because we're starting to get through our paper. Let's get oh. okay again eight and a half by eleven. Let's see if we can't use up some of these scraps. Excuse me. I'm just digging over here and all my my scraps. I was looking for something that has butterflies like that instead of this. Ooh. Maybe that. Take these down to 11. Let's cut. Let's cut. Three quarters of an inch off. Okay. Hopefully these are the same. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Three quarters of an inch off. So now these are two and three quarters by 11. Okay, two and three quarters by 11. I'm going to go about a half an inch away from the edge. Okay. 
Now, with this, each of the strip that we cut off, we're going to put the opposite on. Okay. I'm just going to use this one as a template. All right, so one will be at the bottom, one will be at the top. Or do we want this one to be at the top? So it kind of frames. And put this one at the bottom. So it kind of frames that one. Yep. Eeks. Darn it, I got those on my paper. Crap. Usually you can rub those right off. What's the deal? Huh. There, got it. Yikes! That was dangerous. I think I'll corner this one. All right, so now we have that. All right, I'm going to grab black, I think. Or do I want to use yellow? Let's use yellow. And I'm going to make two of them at five and three quarters by eight. Five and three quarters by eight. Okay. Five and three quarters by eight. Love it. Love it. Okay. Try and center it. Okay. like that beautiful so I like that now um that's by eight 
You can either put two photos on it, one photo, do embellishments. Um, Mm. <coughs> well, this side would be okay with that, and this side would have to be... <coughs> so, <coughs> excuse me, that's eight. <coughs> Half is four, so... Five and a half, okay? So cut this down to five and a half. <coughs> okay. So three and three quarters would work. Wish I had another one of those. Or maybe let's look at our pad. Let's try this. Three and three quarters. Oh, I need to cut it down to five and a half first. So three and three quarters. So if I put one here, and then the blue one here, put the blue one here because you got blue over here, and then three and three quarters. Perfect. Perfect. Looking at all my embellishment. Oh. I'm looking up here. We don't have no journaling spot. Let's look at a tag. Maybe. There's blues. Maybe that would be better. that one against that gingham. Maybe that one. Ooh. What about this one? There. There we go. Perfect. I like it. Another one for scraps. I mean, that's what we got a lot of. Right. 
Okay. Eight and a half by eleven. Got those left over. These were just left over from our yellow cuts earlier. I'm over here digging in my strips. Still digging, sorry. Still digging. I don't know, maybe do we want to try and use these? Now this one's a little bit bigger. Let's take it down to whatever this one is. It looks like three, it's almost just a hair under three and three quarters. I'm going to take this one down. See, these aren't the same size. I don't know if pink really goes very well or not. <coughs> Cut this one in half. Oops. Yeah, so I should be attaching some of it. I have this big pink one left over. I don't know about pink. Of course, I got pink right there. 
Now we haven't even used this dark blue yet. Or should we just use black? Let me see. Let's see what a six and a quarter. Six and a quarter by four and a quarter. All right. There's some lemons. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a ladybug. Two ladybugs. grab our embellishments. Happy sunshine. So if we do those in yellow, I don't want those in yellow. Happy. <coughs> You're the best. Uh-oh. On there twice. We got happy there twice. That was dumb. You're the best. You got this. Wish I had a different one, but I think I'm out of those. Unless the lemon just the lemon ain't bad. I think that's all I've got of those. I don't think that would go very well. Yeah, I think that's all I've got of them. 
now do we want a yeah this may complicate it I say we put a tag um, or we can cut we can cut the top off okay and then Uh, you're probably going to hear this semi coming. Guys, Jake break on pretty good. So I apologize. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Oh, my God. Why they... The, let's um, let's back those with a little bit of black. Um, nope. I'm trying to see if I have a big enough piece in my pile over here. Yep. Oh, I moved that. All right, let's do her. Um, I'm just going to hold this right now and trim it. Because I think this is going to go... Or should we just... Yeah, it needs to go all the way to the end. Okay, I'm just going to glue it. And it can just go all the way to the end. And the yellow can go all the way to the end over here. So I probably just messed everything up. Okay. Let's get this one. Now I might take that strip out and just put that in the middle. Now that's this one's a little bit busy. Just a little bit. We're not even at an hour. We've already done three three layouts. Wow. Wow. Three three layouts. And we st still got time. Um let's go ahead and let's go ahead and end this um class. Um I hope you enjoyed the class. Um I hope you will um, want to go sit down and craft and hopefully I sparked something. Um, go create something beautiful. All right. 
All right. We'll see you in the next class. So we'll see you next Friday. As always, keep scrapping. Bye-bye.